This is group A, complete the dials. Okay. So, um, the distillery in Kawaka Museum was a um, was the brainchild of our fourth generation uh, master blender, Julius Limpe, my grandfather. Um, he purchased this house in 1979. So, this wasn't really a factory, it was a residential building that he bought to, with the full intention of creating a museum. Um, as early as the 80s, we had a museum here, but we... Yes. By the original. Yeah, it, it, it still looks it's like that. It's very same. Yes. It, it still looks... No, this is, the, this is the museum, the picture of the museum in the 80s. So, so, so in the 80s, there was a museum there, but it was always private until last year where we opened it to the public. Um, during that time, we went through a lot of different, like a lot of different changes um, within the museum. So we fixed the flow, we, we put stuff in, we brought things out. This is a behind the button. We didn't really change much of us, except the wording in the museum and patching up the mga holes, um, which we assume are for bullets. Oh. Okay, so please follow me. Yeah. And then later, um, after tour, we can have lunch outside. So present the, present the Hi, bye. Hello. <laughs> Uh, what's the significance of the carabao carving in there? Okay, so I will explain. Everyone, please. So the main intention of this museum is really to show the history of the, fa the family and the company, but also through the story of liquor making. Um, this is the traditional way of ah, oh, yeah. making, Sugar uh, cane. making fermented beverages in the Philippines. Um, we're, we're showing here now how, um, how people used to make basi. Um, or actually till now, this is how they make it. Um, this is just an old version of a dadapilan. Sugar cane yeah, yeah. I know that. So it's carabao drawn. So carabao goes around. So the pillars would move inwards. Sugar, ano, sugar, sugar cane stalks are fed inside. And then crushed. The juice will flow here. This portion. And then it's collected in a jar. Later on, it will be cooked in a tawa. And then fermented. Yeah. Um, traditionally, in Basi, they still add um, some bark, some leaves, some herbs um, to create um, the traditional Basi as we know it. Also sugar, they add sugar. So here's an example of okay, a carabao drawing by the people. I've seen it in action in vegan. Yes, exactly. So, so Basi is really a Ilocano beverage. And we also have a video sample of a more automatic na, um, sugar cane crusher. This one is in Mahol. So, no more oh, carabao. Okay. Pero they say, when they have tourists, they strap on a carabao oh. <laughs> <laughs> for the romance of it all. <laughs> Please, come in. Carabao bag. Since 1852. Oh. So, the company started in 1852. Ah, ito yung Shoktong. Everybody. Yeah, I heard that Shoktong. Shoktong? Shoktong. Oh, <laughs> so, so the company started in 1852. It was started by a Chinese immigrant. His name was Lim Tuaho. That was his own name. Um, so his last name was Lim. And then Tuaho was his given name. Um, later it was anglicized. Uh, and then he... Lim Tuaho became his surname. And then he took on the first name Bonifacio. Shok Hok Tong was his first product. Um, mm. It was a family recipe for an herbal tonic. Yeah. So people would drink it for ah, vigor and vitality. Yeah. Um, eventually, Shok Tong would become a general, yeah, like, like, like a generic term na lang for all kinds of herbal tonic. Mm. We don't use this brand name anymore. But we still mm. make it to the same recipe. Mm. Um, using mainly these ingredients. Um, if you look at it, you can tell naman which is which. Like, there's cashew bark, clove, fennel seeds. There's some dried. Uh, dried Why plums. don't you make it anymore? We, we we still make it, but we make it under the brand name Vino di Cino and Vino Cobo. Oh, okay. okay. ah, yeah, what's, what's the new brand name? Uh, Vino di Cino and Vino Cobo. Mm -hmm. And when was it changed? Uh, 
Um, this changed back in the 70s. 70s. So yeah, I remember the, the old people that they they they, they, uh, they, they drink that. Yes. Yeah. Can you buy it over here? Yeah, yeah, of course. It's uh, we 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 can't make any medical claims, but um, now it's mostly consumed by women and for this kind of How long is the first pregnancy? Um, there's actually it's it's um, it's, it's a wild in the sense it's no alcohol, but there's no actual fermentation. It's more masculine. This is the product you know. They are very popular with. White Castle Whiskey Let's proceed here, the area. I don't know the video, the facade. Let's go